Okay, I'm also taking the, or well, trying to eliminate my acne scars. As you can see, I have a few of them over pigmentation. Plus I have moles right here, but that's genetic and whatever. So, I'm washing my face with the DDF Brightening Cleanser. I was using this for my chest and arms and then I stopped using it and then I realized, oh, you know, let me use that for my face. So, that's why it's almost gone. And then I use the Avon Rejuvenate Serum. It's also a glycolic facial treatment. So I'll wash my face with this and I'll wait about five minutes and then apply this. And then I apply the Jamarini Bioglycolic BioClear. It has salicylic acid and it's a skin resurfacing complex, which also has a glycolic acid in it, I believe. And then to moisturize, I'm using the Ambi Even and Clear Daily Moisturizer with SPF 30. Visibly report, correction, visibly even skin tone and texture with soy extract and vitamin C and E. And that's the daytime. Daytime, I'll use this combination. Then at night, on alternating nights, I'll do the same cleanser. And then I won't do the, you know, the um, glycolic. And then I do Retin-A. Wait about 10, 20 minutes and then do the Retin-A. And then on days that I exfoliate, I will exfoliate first with either the Beyond Belief Microdermabrasion Scrub that you can get at Sally's Beauty Supply. This works really good because the um, consistency of the scrub is really fine. And then I also have the Dark Angels. Yay! <laughs> I keep forgetting I have this stuff. So, um... Yeah, we all saw it in your video. I said, well, hey, let me go pull that out. So I'm going to use that also alternating days when I exfoliate. And then sometimes at night I do also use the Avon and then wait and then do the Retin-A. So I'm going to try the combination of these products and see if I can fade these faster and also prevent new acne from forming because... That's my main problem acne right now. So if I get rid of the acne, I won't have to have any marks to get rid of in the future. So I want to get rid of the marks that I have now, which is mainly this one on my nose. And I hardly ever break out on my forehead, but for some reason I've broken out and it's like these freaking marks here and then, you know, that and other stuff. But that's just like, you know, the major ones, but I can cover that up with makeup, but when I go to the gym, I don't want to have to, well, I don't wear makeup, but I want to have, you know, clear skin, you know, the moles and the pores or whatever, but I don't want it to be, have extra marks on my face, you know, I don't want that, so. These are the products that I will be using, and um, I'm thinking I should get pretty good results. Um, I am going to be, moist, like I said, moisturizing, and hopefully, if I see any um, breakouts or anything unusual then of course you know I'm gonna start eliminating products but as of now this is what I will be using to help fade my acne marks and also to help prevent the recurrence of my acne and I'll still use the um, proactive renewing cleanser every now and again like around my period week before I'll start I'll break this out so I will use this and then I will use that and these products, um, this is kind of expensive. I think I got it for about $30 on Amazon. And this was like $35 at uh, Sephora. But it does have um, salicylic acid and a glycolic acid in it also. So I'll see if it's worth it because I totally forgot I had it. So yeah, product junkie. That would be me. So yeah, I'm going to try these products also and see if um, I can get some results as far as fading the acne marks and preventing new acne from form forming my face. So that is all you inspired me to do in the video, my first video. So yeah, that's cool. Alright, I will, like I said, I'll probably post a video every week or so to see, so you can see, you know, without makeup, of course, how it's going. So thanks. Take care.